Two old school lanterns sit rusted stiff in a wet nowhere nook like a pair of elderly elbows weathering an overcast case of rainy arthritis on the porch, cozying into the years of a wicker rocking chair as if that could make them young again. Two old school lanterns. Ancient to the imagination, entwined in the soft hum of rainbow shadows, twinkle hazy like peekaboo clouds cover the moon, phasing in and out to the rusty rhythm of a dusty childhood fantasy, played out in the mind sapia of memories, too close to forget and too perfect to live again. We were astronauts. We were too small for shuttle thrusters, too small for shuttle thrusters. I took my arms and thrust her skywards, and we reached like our feet could leave the ground if we overextended, pretending at that age was a secret code or handshake. Everyone had to have one, and everyone shared with the meek and uncoordinated. Our trash can dilapidated space station under attack from dog acid and garbage truck jaws. We emaciated incoming frontal phasers with super-powered lemonade and a fresh batch of wet chocolate raisin hazelnut cookie batter we secretly integrated with our digestive tracts. <laughs> we stole it from Molly. <laughs> Who's sitting over in the corner right there? Sorry, Mom. They were really good. Just, you know. Um. Oh, okay. So, and then, I was like, it was a sunny day, and across sunbaked concrete curbs and street quarters at a treehouse headquarters, we nationalized the neighborhood inventory of slingshots, pop rocks, and cardboard boxes. There's nothing you can't do with a cardboard box if it's big enough. Just lock and key the lesser of two realities beyond the brown boundaries of a quintessential childhood joy. A cardboard box is like TV entertainment for people with brains because reruns are lame and we run infinite and at times naked no refrains, no restraints, no batteries, half-assed chatterings, ads, infomercials, drama queen, weather women, or painfully poor teleprompting, no complaints. At an age when your mind could fill the sky, your brilliance as big as your boundless heart full of family, friends, and intergalactic diplomacy, you could roam the streets with a cardboard box and snot-nosed posse, and the wind would bend to your wisdom and boredom. That slippery little devil would shiver and shrivel and tremble into dust by your will. Will you remember your childhood? How unequivocally awesome you were. I've got two old school lanterns, and with them a batch of candles and matches that might keep old memories alight, says you will, if you try and keep the kid inside alive.